and YG Gaming here back again with another video. <coughs> so we're back. It's Saturday, it's Master Mode prep day. So you guys know what it is. What I do is I go through my free to play teams for 4,200 points for the Monday Master Mode reset. And I also go through my full strength non free to play team for 7,500 points. I go through their team skills, lucky skills, uh, sync grid, and team compositions that I'm going to be using for the Monday reset. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe, do like the content, do share it around, and if you want to become a member of the Watch Gang, um, hit the join button down below. <laughs> you can join and become a member of Watch Gang. So let's get into the video. Um, okay, so this coming Monday on the reset, we all will be weak to Ghost type. Um, you may have seen me use this uh, two weeks ago, and I used exactly the same team, and it done well with the Ghost. So why not use it again? Um, we've got Gengar here for Hypnosis and we're going to Sync. Um, Lucky Skill is Escape Artist. It's better to have Critical Strike on this if you're going to use it as a, as a striker. Or you can have Troublemaker 1 if you want for Hypnosis to have a better accuracy. And then here's the theme skills I've got. Um, it will have a link with Kanto in here uh, to Giovanni and Mewtwo. And Giovanni and Mewtwo is here for Shadow Ball. Uh, I'm going to use his moves because he will have the critical hit rate up. Lucky skill is critical strike one. Again, if you've got critical strike two, is a lot better than this. And the theme skill that we'll link here with will be Kanto. And again, he hasn't got a grid. And pairing this up with Rosa. Yes, I have Rosa now at three out of five. I did use a support candy. I just wanted to see how Master Healer 2 worked. And I was not impressed. <laughs> Master Healer 2 is not what you'd expect it to be for Giga Drain. But uh, if there is ever a grass week, Master mode, I will use this uh, to see how much Hugo Drain actually takes. Uh, lucky skill here is Enlightenment 9, but again, it's better to have Vigilance on this. And here's all the theme skills, but it will not matter in this team. And on the grid, I've got all the Giga Drain power ups, Energy Ball power ups, Giga Master Healer 2, uh, Special Attack MP Refresh 2, Time to Energize MP Refresh, and Giga Drain Move Game Refresh. Now, if you have seen my 2 out of 5 grid in the previous episodes for Rosa, use that instead. It's, it is as good as it is 3 out of 5. So if you've got support candy, don't use it on Rosa. 2 out of 5 is enough uh, for her. Moving on to my full strength team, and you guys have seen this team already. Um, you even see, saw it on Master of Madness when I about C, and I used Morty and Driftbloom. Um, however, in this team, I've got Dusknor for raising critical hit and attack. Lucky skill here, I've got his unflappable. Uh, it will have the Ghost Level 4 theme skill, which will give it a buff. And on the grid, I've got Shadow Punch Move, Gauge Refresh, uh, Critical Fortification 6, Die Hit All MP Refresh and Unbreakable Bonds um, MP Refresh, and Team Toughen Up 4. And pairing this up with Starmie for Evasiveness to raise Drift Bloom's Evasiveness as quickly as he can. Uh, then I've got Vigilance on the theme skill, and again, here's all the theme skills I've got. Uh, the one that we'll link will be Gym Leader. And this grid here that I've got for Starmie is a 2 out of 5 grid, even though I've got Starmie at 5 out of 5, so it's more easily available for you to use. Uh, Agile Entry 1, Bubble Beam, Move Gauge Refresh, Catching If You Can, MP Refresh, and X Special Defense, MP Refresh. So the main star here is Drifalum EX, which is here for Phantom Force and Sinking. He can raise his own stats as well. Lucky Skills Grip for Strike 2. Uh, theme skill as uh, the level four, the level four ghost, which will activate for uh, Dustnor and the gym user as well. And on the grid here, I've got Sync Node Power Ups, Blind Spot, Demoralize One, Phantom Force MP Refresh Free, and Pairs Develop MP Refresh Free. So that's the full strength for non-free to play team. Moving on to free to play for the next Elite Four member, that is Koga, and he is weak to fire. So this is the team I'm going to use for Koga, for free to play. Uh, I've got Torchic here to raise the critical hit, special attack and attack of the team. Lucky Skill got his defense crush 2 and level 4 and fire will give the whole team a buff. Uh, I haven't used Marley and Arcanine as much so I thought why not try it here. So we've got here for we're standing strong and X special X Beetle. A lucky Skill, again it won't matter here but it's better to have Vigilance. And we've got the level 4 on fire. And again, he has not, or she has not got a grid. Um, next is Silver and Ho. -Oh. I thought, why not use Silver? <laughs> um, legendary unit now got a grid. Uh, I've gone for the overheat grid. Um, lucky skill is Dauntless. 
uh, theme scale level form file. Um, so overheat accuracies, RAM and speed, inertia, solar flow 5, fast track 3, and I'll show you MP refresh 2 and overheat move gauge refresh 3. So Arcanine will give it the speed boost for RAM and speed and inertia. When he sinks, he'll have the sun and he can hit hard. So that's free to play. Non free to play is this. Um, I thought let me test out um, Egg and Nine Tails, see how it is for Sunny Day. Uh, lucky Skill is Enlightenment Fire again. I haven't put too much luck into Lucky Skills into this. Uh, theme Skills I will make level 4 fire after this. Uh, next is Lily and Clefairy, which is here for full power just to make Charizard as quickly as he can to raise all his stats. It's better to have Vigilance on Clefairy, but I've got Stoic 2. Uh, and again, the theme skills here will not matter, but the main star here is Charizard, but the lucky skill Critical Strike 2. Uh, theme skill is level 4 on fire. And on the grid, I will be using the Sun Sync grid, which is this one over here. I've uh, got the Sync No Power Ups, Flare Bits Plow Up, Power Ups, Solar Flare 5, and I've got Haymaker as well. And that is what I'm going to go for for full strength um, against Koga. Uh, for free to play, uh, next is Bruno. Uh, this is the free to play team I'm going to use. I'm going to use Gramble here to lower the attack of Bruno. Uh, copy his stats with what great composition and then just bam attack with Dazzling Gleam. Lucky skill, I've got a Stoic 1. And I've got the level 4 and Fairy for the theme skills. And again, he has not got grid. Uh, next, I've got uh, Valerie and Sylveon, which is here for basically raising its own special attack. And it can also raise their own special defense and speed. Then I'll just be spamming Draining Kiss to just basically heal and attack. Uh, if you've got Critical Strike 2 on this, is a lot better, but I've got Power Reserves 1. Uh, then you've got Level 4 in Fairy for the theme skill. And again, has not got a grid. Uh, the main star though is Xerneas. And Xerneas here is going to be used for Horn Leech. Lucky skill is Vigilance. A theme skill is again Level 4 on Fairy. And on the grid, Recuperation 1, Impervious, Master Healer 1 on the Horn Leech, times 2, and the world is vast MP refresh. So that is free to play. Non free to play uh, is this team over here. So I've got Bergen Togepi, uh, which is basically here to raise the critical hit, defenses, potion, um, vigilance is the lucky skill, level 4 on the theme skill, fairy, and I've got the healing grid on. So team healing, super hit 9, unbending, stalwart. Potion Master Healer 1s, MP Refresh 2s on Potion. Uh, then I've got Dawn and now Creamy for Charm to lower the attack. Or I can also choose to lower the uh, Special Defense with Fake Tears. Uh, I can also use How Sweet to raise the Special Attack and Gradual Healing for Guard uh, Lucky Skills Vigilance. And then I've got the Theme Skill Level 4 in Theory. Uh, on the grid, I've got First Aid 4, Healthy Healing, How Sweet MP Refresh 2. Uh, I do have Charm MP Refresh and uh, move gauge refresh and fake turn move gauge refresh as well. So it's going to act as a tech. Uh, then I've got God of All, which is here for moon blast and sinking. Uh, lucky skills critical strike 2, theme score level 4 and fairy. And on the grid, I've got the sink moon power ups, double down 2, devastation, and moon blast and move gauge refresh 2. Um, this team will easily win it. I've done it before two weeks ago. Uh, next is Karen, and Karen will be weak to bug. And this is my free to play team to use against Karen. Uh, I've got Medicham here to raise the attack and critical hit of the team. Lucky skill is Defense Crush 1, and we do have the level 4 on the fighting, but the one that will matter here is the gym leader. And again, he hasn't got a grid. Uh, then we've got Mascarena Viola, which is basically here to trap and lower special attack. Lucky skill is Unflappable, uh, then we've got the level 4 on Bug. Then we've got First Aid 4, Stationary Target 5. Um, we've got Pokey Trap 2, MP Refresh 2, so I, our, our tactic here is just to basically trap first and then lower special attack. And then we've got Cypher, which is here to use Slash, raise his own critical hit and attack. Lucky skill is Critical Strike 2, and on his passive he has Critical Strike 3, so that gives him Critical Strike 5, and he does have the bug level 4 team skill. Uh, so that's free to play, uh, non free to play is here. So we've got Viola and Masquerade with the same sync grid, theme skills and lucky skills. It's basically there to trap. Uh, then we've got Lily and Rabombi for raising evasiveness and also using Dire Hit All for critical hit. 
uh, lucky skills vigilance uh, and then we have the level four bug and on the grid we've got the leech life grid so we've got team toughen up three uh, master healer one on leech life uh, leech life move gauge refresh low and lang san uh, mp refresh and die hit mp refresh two uh, and then the main star here is Alder EX, so he's here, he can put plus 6 on his special attack in the first turn and then he can also lower special attack and then spam hyper beam. Uh, Lucky skill is unbending, uh, just because when you do use, um, I think, uh, unparalleled power, his defense does go down, so that's there to prevent it. And we've got the level 4 on bug on his theme skill. Um, and then we've got Hyper Beam Accuracy, we've got Devastation, we've got Hyper Beam Move Gauge Refresh, and we also have Struggle Bomb Move Gauge Refresh. And that is the grid that we are going for for non free to play. Moving on now to the last Elite Four member, and that is Lance, and he is weak to water. So, what I thought I'd do is I was going to use Empoleon, but I've been using him for too many weeks, so I'm switching it out and using Cyrus and Palkia now. Um, so my Pokemon here that I'm going to use here is Swan off to raise speed, um, which you'll see why. Uh, it will act as a healer as well. Lucky skills vigilance. Uh, team skill is gym leader, which will link nicely to Lieutenant Search. And oh, let me show you the grid. Uh, on the grid, I've got Master Healer ones, Custom Engage Refresh nine, Potion MP Refresh twos, Take Flight MP Refresh three. Uh, then I thought, let me use my BP Sync Pair, and I've used Raichu here, which is here for 10 heart. So it's here to raise the critical hit of um, uh, Palkia. And I've also got Thunder Wave, so if I need to paralyze, I can paralyze as well. Uh, I've got Vigilance on the Lucky Skill, and then Theme Skill Level 4 and Gym Leader. And on the grid, I've got First Aid 4, Quick Cure, Endurance, uh, 10 heart MP Refresh 3. Um, and I've got Thunder Punch, Fast Strike 3, and Thunder Punch, Move Gauge Refresh. Um, so that's what I've gone for for Raichu. And then Palkia here is used for Hydro Pump. And for Sinking, uh, I've got Critical Strike 2 on the Lucky Skill. Um, again, the deep skills here won't matter in this team. And I am going for the Hydro Pump grid. So all the Hydro Pump power ups, Accuracy plus 15, uh, Refreshing Rain 1, I am a Hydro Pump. Move Gauge Refresh and Hydro Pump Ramming Speed. So that critical hit and ramming speed should hit hard uh, from Palkia. And my non free to play is here. <laughs> I'm going to use uh, SS Blue. Uh, so Lucky Skills Vigilance, Team Skill Level 4 Mortar. Uh, on the grid, I've got Team Triage Tank 2, Racing Ring 2, Raging Ring 3, Refresh and Ring 1, to the top MP Refresh 3, X Defense or MP Refresh 3. And then I've also got Main Swamper EX, which is here for basically Muddy Water. On the theme skill, there is Super Duper Effective 1, theme skill level 4 on water. And on the grid, I've got the, the Muddy Water Accuracy 5, Refresh and Wayne 1, uh, Inclement Intellect 6, uh, Muddy Water Move Gauge Refresh, Rain Dance Move Gauge Refresh, Rain Dance MP Refresh 2, and Ready for this MP Refresh 2. And the main star here is Kyogre and Archie EX. Lucky skill is Critical Strike 1. Team skill is level 4 Mortar. And on the grid, Raiden Gear 2, Shower Power 3, Shower Sync, and also the um, Sync No Power Ups. Oh, those are the teams I'm going for for non free to play and free to play. So, um, non free to play, I'm aiming for 7,500 points, so 1,500 points for each round. Free to play, I'm aiming for 4,200 points, uh, 850 points per round, and the last one against Lance, 800 points. Um, I do get a lot of comments now saying why not do 7,500 points for free to play. I could do that, but as you can see from my account, um, all my sync pairs are maxed out, so it's a bit difficult for me to do, especially with the levels as well being level 135 in what team free to play for those free to play. Um, if I had a baby count there, I would do it. Um, Maybe I'll do it in some time in the future, but for now it's just 4,300 points is doable. And if you do have them at a lower level, it's more easier for you to achieve. And that is the minimum amount of points that you really want to achieve if you want the five star power ups. Um, so yeah, that's the end of the video. Uh, do like the content, do share it around, do subscribe. And if you want to join my gang, <laughs> click that button down below. And that is the end of the video. And I will see you all for tomorrow for something special. So I'll see you all there. 
tomorrow. See ya.